many Earthmen waiting for suitable transportation to the planets and beyond become do-it-yourself astronomers. Three generations of the Hodges family in Regina grind their own lenses and assemble their own telescopes in a basement workshop. Hours of painstaking, delicate work must be spent on a telescope before any stargazing can begin. Regina Astronomical Society provides the Hodges and 40 other amateur stargazers with the advantages of group study and opportunities to show off their equipment. Daylight hours are spent setting up their instruments for evening observation and viewing sunspots. On grounds leased from Regina College, the Society built its observatory and a small clubhouse where celestial affairs are studied informally. Members are proud of their reports to the Dominion Observatory at Ottawa, and many of their observations have been published in astronomical journals. Braced by a supply of hot coffee, the astronomers begin their watch at nightfall. Through some 20 telescopes, eyes are trained on the infinite panorama above with a few local interruptions by the insect population. The society's observatory is often occupied long into the early morning hours. Ed Madgeton is usually there on a clear prairie night studying the characteristics of variable stars, stars which glow and fade periodically. Madgeton intends to devote his life to astronomy, the most ancient of sciences. His research will enrich the fundamental knowledge of our tiny planet and its neighbors in far-off space.